a local treasure is getting a facelift. City crews have spent the past two weeks at Choice Lake and Oak Park spreading truckloads of gravel onto the trail, a 0.8 mile loop popular among visitors, walkers, and nature lovers. Uh, we're covering the walking trail around the lake with a uh, road base or gravel. And what this is going to do is it's going to create a better walking environment for our users. Crews are taking precautions ahead of the El Nino rains. Another task, removing the dead or dying trees, some that date back to the early days of this park space in 1905. Well, as you can see, we are in a wonderful eucalyptus, old growth eucalyptus grove uh, around the lake. It's a wonderful place to walk. It's shady, but unfortunately these trees do have a lifespan and we have lost, uh, I believe it's six fully grown, 65 foot plus trees in the last year. It's not just city staff hard at work. The Park and Rec Department relies on community volunteers to help with maintenance across the 145 acres of Choice Lake Park. Stocked with bass, trout, and catfish, this is a popular spot for kids who want to learn how to fish. Plans are also underway to replace or repair playground equipment and even resurrect a once popular day camp. Having the benefit within this uh, community to have a, a, a lake in the area, uh, a body of water that you hardly ever see unless you go to the west coast on the beach, um, you're able to enjoy the, the uh, nature, the environment, see the birds. This Saturday, the public is invited to a celebration for the reopening of Choyas Lake a place well-loved by those who just visit and those who call this place home.